here is Minecraft loading on my Chromebook. This is the easiest and the fastest way to get Minecraft on your Chromebook. Now the first step is getting the Linux terminal. Hit the search bar and type in settings. Now once your settings loads up, go to the bottom left and hit advanced. Go down to developers and make sure your Linux environment is enabled so that you can have the Linux terminal. Alternatively, you can go to the top and type in Linux and it should lead you to the same exact place. Step 2 is getting the Linux terminal commands which is linked down in the Google Docs description down below. Now go ahead and hit set. And once you hit set, just go ahead and type in Linux which will bring up the terminal. Once you have your terminal open, what we're going to do is that we're going to copy each one of these codes from code 1 to code 8 and then we're going to paste it right in the terminal. So for now, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to copy code 1 and then I'm actually going to zoom out and go back to my terminal. CTR Shift V should do exactly the job. I've pasted it and I'll let it do its job. I'm going to go ahead and copy code 2, go back to the terminal and then CTR Shift V again, copy it there. But this time we're going to see yes or no. This is Y slash N. You want to type in Y so that the program can keep going. I copy the third one. I go down to terminal again. And then I paste that third one in there again. Now I'll just let it do its job once again. Copy the fourth one. Do the same thing by going to the terminal and pasting it. Go again and copy the fifth one. Go back to your terminal. Like it's a repetitive um kind of thing you want to do is just terminal based that is why and here you repeat the why again and then you just keep on if you guys have found this video really helpful so far kindly subscribe hit the bell button and hit the like button because it helps me out a ton it's just repetitive copy paste copy paste copy paste and then it should be done so i'm going to do this for seven and eight so that i don't waste so much time on the video and uh, just a side note right 8 is where all the magic starts to happen like where you see that minecraft is now actually being started to um, update to copy files to bring in new things which is minecraft hyphen launcher so this is going to start the minecraft um, launcher downloading and then i'm gonna like the video is skipped in part so bear, bear, like bear with me for the meantime it's skipped them um, in part just so that i can finish quickly now the Minecraft launcher after updating is going to open what we're familiar with as a Minecraft interface where you're supposed to log in and stuff like that. So here we are after a long day of trying to pull in a lot of codes. I'm going to input my login the details and come back later. So now I have my input details being logged in. I'm going to choose what release version I want to play and I'll click play. And then from there it should give me it should start downloading the version that I wanted to play and then I should be able to play it. It's just that basic. It's um, code and terminal intensive in comparison to um, the other crouton part of it. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this video was really helpful to you guys. If you have any questions, kindly drop that in the comment section so that I can help you out with your problems or whatever you're facing. So that's it guys, kindly try to smash the subscribe button Hit the like button and join my Discord down in the description because that helps me out a ton. And with that said, I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out, boys.